I'm meteorologist Keith Kipson. Your forecast for tonight: some severe weather is possible. Not everyone's going to see it, but some severe weather is possible starting in the west about 8 o'clock and then in our eastern zones sometime after 2, maybe after 3. Wind and hail, the primary concerns if we do see some organized severe weather. Uh, can't rule out a brief tornado or two with the setup, but the uh, overall threat of that uh, fairly low with this setup. You can see Futurecast picking up on this line of storms here by mid-evening. That will cross I-55 and get into our viewing area after 8 o'clock it would appear. And then by midnight, uh, approaching the Golden Triangle area and then shifting into Alabama sometime after midnight. And that's the way it's looking. It should be out of here by 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning. That's going to set up some pretty nice weather for our Thursday. Speaking of Thursday, we're looking at a mix of sun and clouds, a nice day, temperatures in the mid 70s. Now, looking ahead, we have another system that will get organized by Friday. We may see a stray shower storm here in North Mississippi Friday afternoon, uh, but now it looks like the strongest storms Friday uh, night into Saturday will be just off to our northwest, and that's where the the greatest severe threat is going to be as we start the weekend. Now we're going to be watching this area of low pressure back to the southwest in Texas late Saturday. That's going to spiral our way for Sunday. That will give us another chance for some strong storms, also some heavy rainfall as we close out the weekend. And yes, more severe weather is possible on Sunday. Here's your 70 forecast. You can see we have a roller coaster ride of temperatures. Mid 70s Thursday, pushing 90 Friday and Saturday. Very warm, very humid. Uh, breezy at times. Severe weather possible Sunday. Nice early next week, and then we could see another active event by the middle of next week.